Okay, so in the newspaper today, we have the headline from um, the Daily Record in New Jersey. Shock Jock Stern takes credit for breaking pre-story. <laughs> A hairstylist for radio personality Howard Stern said on yesterday's show that as a boy, he witnessed the then pastor of the Church of St. Joseph in Medham sleeping in a bed with another boy. Ralph Sorella, who was a member of the parish at the time, said he slept on the floor of the rectory that night before going on a fishing trip with the pastor, James Hanley. Allegations of pedophilia against a priest... Did you know you're in the paper? No. Yeah. I, I, what is this? Allegations of pedophilia against a priest had been the subject of a routine on the Stern Show last month. Sorella had said that the priest had taken out pornographic materials when he stayed in the rectory. However, the priest was not identified at the time. And I should add to this story that a lot of people recognized who Ralph was talking about because he mentioned the area, and they all called in. And, and I would say this is more than a month ago. Yeah. Hanley, now retired from the Catholic Church, has been accused of molesting at least four boys at the parish from the 70s until, the late, until he left Medham in 1982. He's retired because he got, you know, Mendo. he had enough of young boys. Yeah. The allegations were the subject of a meeting last week called by the present pastor, Monsignor Kenneth Lash. Stern read extensively from an article in the Daily Record yesterday and took credit for breaking the story weeks ago. He said a number of people called this show to say they knew about the priest Sorella was talking about and had similar experiences. I think a lot of them went came forward after that. Yeah, yeah. And, and a complaint to the uh, priest. Sorella was not available for comment yesterday. <laughs> Where were you? He was shaving his leg. <laughs> Quote, I had heard rumors that someone connected to the Howard Stern show was from Mendham, Lash said yesterday. Bendham. Rumors. <laughs> Bendham. Bendham. <laughs> the insinuation was he was going to do some sort of story about this, but we were well on the way to holding our meeting. I can tell you most assured, assuredly Howard Stern did not break this story. Well, I can tell you most assuredly, Monsignor. Yeah, but then, then why? Yeah, did, we did. When, when this why all happened, of a sudden did everyone eight, eight come forward? Eight years ago, yeah. when they knew about it, they didn't do anything. Now all of a sudden they're doing something. All the people who came forward, at least I think two of them came forward on this show. Yeah, that guy called the guy who called in. Yeah, we told him to do something about it. Lash, who arrived in Mendham one year after Hanley left, said he first learned of the allegations seven or eight years ago. Well, why didn't? Uh... How come it took so long to hold a meeting? He has refused Planning. to be more specific because of a pending civil lawsuit. Uh, how come all these Monsignors and all these priest types are worried about children? And he learned about it eight years ago and didn't do anything about it. Well, what was he going to do? The Morris County Prosecutor's Office conducted a probe two years ago, but no charges were filed since the statute of limitations had expired. That's, that's a neat little statute. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Lash said last week's meeting of parishioners were not connected to Stern Show or to the pending lawsuit. He said all along that he was waiting for the victims to approve of the meeting. It took him eight years to yeah. approve of the meeting. I would have called the meeting first. I'm sure what happened was everybody, they started making, it, it just surfaced everything. Why would you wait eight I mean, years? Because if that guy now is out in the private sector, he could be molesting boys yeah. in the private sector. You don't know that. If I was a oh. priest and I had this information, I'd come forward immediately. You have to move very slowly on these things. I see. Give the guy plenty of time. <laughs> Sitting here with us is Monsignor Mental. Now, you uh, have yeah. been with a few boys, haven't you? Oh, a few. <laughs> now, I, I know you don't want to... Monsignor Mental, yeah. you... Uh, you uh, first, uh, you, well, how would you meet the boys? How would you seduce them? Well, I have a mantra. Right. Tight is right. Oh. And you keep repeating that. Now, you try oh, to resist. Yes, I do. You yes. try to resist the boys, don't you? I, oh, I do. I pray to our Jesus, our Savior. Right. For resistance and strength, but it, sometimes it wears away. You know, you sound like a little bit the guy from The Wizard of the Oz. Oh, yes. The Wizard of Oz. Yes, yes. Yeah, right. yes. That guy. <laughs> oh, yes. Now, what about you? Would you like to uh, practice in uh, Mendham? Bend them. <laughs> Mend them. That's my favorite place. It is. You like oh, that place. Oh, yes, 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 yes. yes. Now, <laughs> now, now, I understand you've been uh, you've been with young boys a long time, but nobody ever reports you. Is that correct? Sometimes I let them wear my silly hat. <laughs> you do, the boys? for favors. Oh, is that right? Oh, yes. So you have, what do you have, a big uh, hat that you wear during services? Oh, yes, uh, a big garbage can. <laughs> and you let the boys, you, you invite the boys in to wear your they, hat? They crush up a little piece of paper and throw them in when right. I walk by. Right. Church. Yes. So yes. what you're saying is that you actually yes. tell the boys, hey, come back and try on my garbage can size hat. Oh, yes. And they get excited and yes, they come and back my, there. My incense. You make it a game. You make a game out of it. A little game. My incense and my smoking pocketbook. <laughs> my <laughs> basketball. My purse that I wave the right. smoke. Yeah. Yes. Jeez. You love that. Oh, yes. Sometimes I finish into my hat. Right. 
Hello, hat. <laughs> yeah, hat is your best friend. <laughs> so, okay, so... Jesus so, loved little boys, too, you know. Right, but... but what do you uh, say? Oh, yes, I know, I have proof, yes. <laughs> no, you do not. I read the Bible. See, that's your problem. You try to the back... Blue every... Bible. <laughs> the blue Bible. The blue Bible. You have a blue Bible. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. yeah he, he. So, let me ask you this. Um, you, you if have... they bite me, I smack them with my purse. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> well, looking at Ralph, would you be interested in him? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, he, he like grew him. up just fine. <laughs> yes. Yes. He's very stable. You <laughs> <laughs> see me when I was younger, Father. Now, do you ever fall in love, Father, with some of these little boys? Well, you know, historically, there was always love in those kind of situations. There were six five-year-olds under the table at the Last Supper. <laughs> I can love it all. You and love, we, were, we, 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 we tried to love, be stately. But Robin asked you a good question. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I, 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 do you ever That's fall... That's a good question, Miss Clinton. <laughs> yeah. Do you ever fall in love with the, uh, with the boys? Oh, yes. You do, you do, you do. I had a mellifluous Easter. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you. Oh, yes, I did. Yeah. yeah, you are my new bean princess. I'd like to put a communion wafer in my pants and let Ralph find it with his tongue. <laughs> Body of Christ. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah. Bing, jang, walla, walla, bing, bang. Oh, Take this, problem. all of you, and eat it. For this is Father my mental. body. Father Mental. Yeah. You, uh, Father Mental. Yes, Father Mental. You, I'm disguising your name. You, you told me to. <laughs> Father Mental, yeah. you... Put you, a blue dot over my face. I don't want anyone to see who I am. People shouldn't really get the am. wrong impression. You really have good intentions. It's just that you can't resist the urge. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. You, the, church was, the church was a good sanctuary for, for men like me that didn't want to quite admit their, their true feelings. Right. And rather than act on them, we, we sort of hid in the church. Right. Did you? Would you say some of the boys came on to you? I'm not saying that. I, I, I no, but a lot of young times, Fanny is my drug. <laughs> <laughs> no, but a lot of times I'm it, weak. I'm a weak man. A lot of times, what do you want from me? A lot of times the boys search you, you out. Isn't that me? true? You know they're wearing those what little white uh, from me? You robes. So no, you rape them. You you the, the boys are a little confused and they I'd search like you. to give that Ralphie boy a holy water enema. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to do. That's what I would like very much. You would like that? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. So well, what was your thing? How did you get the boys? Uh, into your chamber. I used to take the rosary beat. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Father Mental, uh, and I'd put them in little places. Father Mental, I just want to go on record as saying yes. that I definitely had something to do with breaking the Ralph Sorella story. And, and I had something to do with breaking Ralph. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Yes. Would you ever... Long ago in Vendom, New Jersey. <laughs> All right. Yes. Very good. Thank you, Father Mental. <laughs> That's Father Mental. Mm. Thank you, I'm Ralph. like the tortoise. I get there before the air. <laughs> Good for you. Oh, yes, I do. Think about it. Yes. That's an amazing statement. Yes. Yes. Cuckoo. <laughs> Ralph, you didn't have any hair, did you, when you... Uh... No, I think I was pretty smooth at that point. <laughs> right. Okay, very good. Congratulations to you, Ralph. They bend for a Snickers bar, and then I give them my autograph. <laughs> Father Mental. <laughs> All right, Father Mental. Thank you, and we got to take a break. You know, on. I used to tie a tootsie roll around my manliness and blow <laughs> them in. Right. <laughs> Entice them. Yeah. All right, Father Mental. Thank you, and we're going to take a short break. We'll Yours come... in Christ. <laughs> okay, when we come back, we're going to uh, do the news, take maybe a few phone calls. We'll see what happens, Rob. We'll see how much time. Uh, we don't have any time. Let's uh, just do the news. Let's do the news, right? The little ones make such strange noises. <laughs> All right, we're going uh, to be back after this. Hey, you know what's weird? Ralph told me this during the commercials that his mom still doesn't know that he was part of that whole molestation story with father. She doesn't even. I don't. She doesn't father even know. The, she, there's no way she knows the story because she's in Florida. <laughs> so she doesn't even know that the guy that she used to send you out to get counseling was uh, like a pedophile. Yeah. Well, you want to call her and tell her? I, I don't. I don't that'd know. We, we, that's what we've been thinking about. about. Should we tell her on the air? Yeah. Yeah. Mother's Day. <laughs> yeah, I, <laughs> could she handle it? I, I mean, yeah, I, I didn't. I, nothing really happened to me, so I mean. Yeah, we ought to tell her. I mean, and I've been trying to tell her, like, like last night. Why don't you write down her phone number and let Gary get her on the phone, and we'll tell her. How about you know what? How about I go call her first and like see if she's up and you know make sure. All right. Well, just, uh, yeah. All right. Hurry up. All right. Gee, you're so nice to your mother. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Howard. Wouldn't it be great if she got on? She went like. So, that's my son. <laughs> she talks like Ralph. She talks like Ralph, like yeah, this. I'm sleeping. I have no idea. My son had this happen to him. Oh, Mom, I hope you don't reverse the charges. 
I wonder what she'll react, uh, how she'll react. Knowing she sent Ralph <laughs> hey, well, to the priest. I'm going to ask her why, why the hell would you send him to a priest? Those guys. Well, back in those days, people thought priests well, could be trusted. <laughs> Days when priests had a good. <laughs> yeah, when That's nobody why it was suspected so a easy thing. For them. Everybody was unaware. Yeah. Now you're late. I mean, I'd be afraid to leave my kids alone in a room with an adult. <laughs> oh, all these adults are sick. Well, what are you? I don't know. I'm the one guy who isn't. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I just don't have an attraction to little children. I guess I'm weird. Well, you you soon will have. Yeah. If you keep getting older and your attraction to women keeps getting younger. Yeah, maybe eventually I will. <laughs> it happens. Yeah. No. You used to be attracted to women your age. Years ago, I mean, priests had it made. JFK had it made. Everyone had it made. <laughs> Mum's the, the word back then. Look at all these reporters, and they all know I'm cheating, but they don't uh, write it. He would bring the girls past the reporters. Hello, reporters. Yeah. This is my new girl. Yeah. <laughs> Where's my pot? You have to respect the president of the United States. Uh, the president is humping. <laughs> father, you know There's a sign hanging on the door. <laughs> if the house is rocking, don't come knocking. Right. <laughs> Ask not. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with Ralph, but evidently he's trying to get his mom on the phone. Okay. What happened? What? Where's your mom? She's on the phone. Oh. Well, put her through. Yeah, I don't know how to do that. They're doing it. Oh, cool. <laughs> you be didn't nice, tell her man. anything. I'll be nice. Oh. Hi, hi, Mrs. Sorella. Don't, don't, don't call that. Call that. Why? Yeah. Oh, that's not her name? That's not her name. Oh, well, how do I know that? Hi, Mrs. Ralph. What are we Mrs. talking Salamone. about? Mrs. Salamone. Miss Salamone. Hey, Miss Salamone. Oh, hi, Howard. I never actually spoke to you, have I? Well, embarrass embarrassing once. <laughs> I remember that phone call. It was like the Ralph's first phone call to the show. <laughs> oh, yeah, but that was, that was absurd. Years ago. Years ago. <laughs> well, you know, um, so listen. I'll yeah. just call you mom because I can't Miss Salamone yeah, or call Salami. Call mom. 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 Mom will do. Okay, mom will right. do. So anyway, Ralph is part of a big story that's been appearing in the newspapers. How come? Because we wanted Ralph to break the news to you on the air. Well, what is it? It's this? a wild story. Well, it's in the papers. You might have, you know, we didn't want somebody to call you with it before you found out from Ralph yourself. Yeah. Is this bad news or good news? Well, I think it's good news. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is bad news. Is it bad or is but it But it's good? not bad news about Ralph. No, it's not bad news about I'm, Ralph. I'm fine, Mom. But oh, okay. 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 But, but it's going to come as a surprise to you because you had no idea what was going on. No, I guess I don't. All right, yeah. All right. Anyway, Ralph. So... Ralph is part of a sting operation. Yeah. Right. Okay. Oh, yeah. Should I explain some of it to your mom? Uh, you, you, I don't know. However you. However you <laughs> All right. Let me handle it. I'm a professional. You, you're well, the let man. Howard handle it because I'm curious. Okay. Yeah. All right. Remember when Ralph was a little boy? <laughs> That's right. Dude. Okay. And Ralph didn't have a dad around when he was growing up, right? Right. Okay. So your idea was to get Ralph some counseling, right? You know, to have like you know people in his life, right? Definitely. Especially men. Yes. All right. Yes. So one of your uh, one of your good ideas was to send Ralph to. I guess it was Father Handley. Was the guy's name Father Handley? Yes. Yeah, and Father Handley would help him and take him on fishing trips and stuff. Right. Right. And you would send him there for counseling. Right. Okay. <laughs> right. The, now remember the fishing trip in particular. You remember the fishing trip? Hey, what is this? Yes. Yeah. All right. Listen to this. So, so anyway, Ralph was on the air and he told me that. When he was going to go on the fishing trip, Father Hanley decided that it would be a good idea if, since they were leaving early in the morning, why have Ralph sleep at your house? Why doesn't he come over to his house? Right? I, no, I don't remember that. You're, you don't remember when I, I, I stayed over? With, no. At the rectory? No. You don't remember no. that? Not at all. You dropped me off there. <laughs> Where was I? Are you sure? Yeah. It, it, we, there was a fishing trip or something, and we were going to go in the morning, and you dropped me off the night before. Wow. Well, well time. Well, I guess a tough time, Yeah, right? I guess it was no real big deal to you. Yeah, right. So, anyway, so Ralph goes in. <laughs> it was a memorable night to me. And in order to, you know, get things going, Father Handley <laughs> showed Ralph some pornography. You've got to be kidding. No, and some, um, <gasps> and some, like, <gasps> sex toys. 
Get out of here. Wait, it gets better. <laughs> no, uh, you're fooling some kind of hour. I know no, 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 no. Listen to this. Listen to this. Mom, 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 mom. It's no it's joke. Now it's, it's all true. Why didn't you tell me then? Don't, don't freak out. Don't freak out yet. I'm nothing. already freaking out. That's all right. Well, if you freak out, do it. You know, oh, do, do it on the air. Do it into the receiver. Don't drop the receiver. All right. So wait a second. Listen to this. Oh, I can't believe it. So then, when Ralph's getting ready for bed, when Father Hanley decides to change, and there was another little boy over. The other little boy and Father Hanley were already in bed, according to Ralph. And they invited Ralph to join them. Right. Ralph, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. How come you didn't tell me this then? Because he's stupid. <laughs> anyway, so... I can't believe this. But wait a second. Ralph, and I put him under hypnosis already. Get out of here. Yeah, I have. I had a hypnotherapist. Ralph claims he went to sleep on the floor, even though Father Hanley invited him into the bed. <gasps> we, 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 stayed o we stayed over, and he... He, he said, you know, he had this, he has this huge bed. And he said, you know, he can sleep in the bed, he can sleep on the floor. And I said, uh, you know, I'll, I'll sleep on the floor. He's like, well, there's plenty of room in the bed. But I was a little freaked out because he had, you know, he had these porno magazines and stuff. And it was, he was acting a little oh, weird. Oh, my God. Did he also yeah. give you something to drink? Did he say <gasps> I, I don't tibble or schnapps. Jägermeister. <laughs> yeah, Jägermeister. That's where you got that Jägermeister from. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, Ralph never again wanted to go back to see Father Handley right. or Father Handle Me. Yes, <laughs> yes Howard. And uh, I guess back then, I guess moms trusted priests. I don't think they do anymore. Yeah, I mean, but he was wasn't he a real nice guy? I mean, he like yeah, like we didn't have like it was a ca it was a private school, it was a Catholic school, and at some point, right. my mother just didn't have money to send me. And he still let me go to the school there. Of course, you know why. Because you're hot. Yeah, he wanted wow. to date me. But... Yeah. <laughs> All the way back then. Yeah. Right. I mean, and do you remember, like, I used to go to counseling for, with him, right? You went with Father Schweitzer. Oh, I didn't go to Father Hanlon? Oh, uh, thank I God. Did, yeah. Yeah, Thank well, God Father on. Schweitzer well, was okay. you know okay. what happened to Father Schweitzer? No, no, I'm just kidding. Nothing. <laughs> Father Schweitzer was cool. Yeah. Well, you no, know, wait a minute. I don't know about that because that's when you got really angry and you wouldn't go back anymore and I didn't understand why. That was the reason because of Father Hanley. Father Hanley. Father Hanley, yeah. I, they, I, ca they caused me to lose that house. I can't believe this. You should have told me then. How did they cause you to lose the house? No, oh, no, 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 no. Yes, sir. No, Father, don't. Yes, Father <laughs> Schweitzer put me through. Yes. Terrible. Terrible. No, Maybe but, no, you have a I, it had nothing, no, no, no. It had nothing to do with Father Schweitzer. No, it had nothing to do with Father Schweitzer. I don't even, it had to do with, I don't even remember him. It had to do with Father Handley. I know, but you were counseling with, Schweit with Father Schweitzer, too. Yeah, but... Ralph Father just didn't want to see any more priests. Yeah, he, he, yeah. He, well, you know, he figured he was running 50-50. <laughs> Father Schweitzer was cool, but Father Handley was sort he of a pain in the neck. <laughs> so anyway, so Ralph got all irritated and wouldn't go back, so that's why he wouldn't go back. So now, as a result of Ralph saying this on the air, yeah. and he hadn't even named Father Handley, he just said in the Mendham area, that uh, a lot of boys have stepped forward. Really? Evidently, there's been... Uh, yeah, he's already out of the priest that he's an accountant somewhere, but, you know, they've, yeah, they've it, known about it for eight years. There's been at least four who you have know, come Ralph, forward. You did try to tell me something about Father Hanley, and I reprimanded you for having said something about a priest because I thought that was sacrilegious then. <laughs> what, what, did I, what, what did I say? Well, it's kind of embarrassing. I mean, you were just a kid, and I didn't know that you... Oh, it was terrible, you know. What did he what say? Did say? That he said terrible things on the playground, and I used to have to volunteer there, and I said, no, I've never heard anything like that. You shouldn't talk that way. And, well, you know, for Christmas, what he wanted for Christmas. What did he want? What, what <laughs> Father Hanley wanted? Yeah, you said, boy, Father Hanley, he's not really a priest. And I said, what are you talking about? And you said, you should hear how he talks on the playground. Really? And I, when you told me, I said, oh, how... I, I don't remember. I don't... I, what did he say? I don't remember. You don't remember? Because I, I said, I accused you of hearing other boys say it and, and blaming it on Father Hanley. So what was so Father Hanley saying? He was saying, I, I want, you know, nice big blondes with big boobs. <laughs> oh, like really? That. And I thought that was disgraceful. I thought, no, he... So it would have been better if at least he went with a blonde with big boobs. Yeah. But he did uh, show Ralph a por pornographic well, magazines of women. Yeah, you know, I was I talking know to my, in all fairness to Father <laughs> Hanley. Yeah. I was, I was talking to my other friends at school, and everybody, everybody thought that he was just a cool guy. You know, he used to go to the spaghetti dinner and get like drunk, and you know, <laughs> and, you, you know, and he was just like a fun kind of guy. And he, he was got, a loose priest. He showed everybody porno magazines. Was he young? No, no, mm. it was like, you know, and he was fat, too, and it was kind of, like, oh. disgusting. <laughs> if he had been cuter, would you have gone with him, well, Ralph? maybe. Would you have gotten into the bed if, if he been... was, like, a Calvin Klein model or something? Yeah, right. <laughs> Ralph, <laughs> That's now you just, Ralph, stop that. <laughs> no, I stopped going to that church when I went to visit him for a counseling about you. And the, and the woman there, Yeah. she answered the door, and she said, oh. <laughs> yeah. She was nude. <laughs> no, she said to Father Hanley. She had a vibrator. She, what? No, she said to Father Hanley, what? 
She just said, oh, Father, there's a, a, a lady here to see you, a good looker. He says, well, I'll be right there. And I, I, I was... Then I started thinking about... Is your mom hot? What? Is your mom hot, Ralph? <laughs> Come on, man. This was 10, 12 years ago, Howard. Really? <laughs> and so I... But there, you mean the lady at the church was calling you saying you were a good looker? What was going on in that house? <laughs> what a yeah. church. That, that's, that's exactly, Robin. I said, what is going on here? Why don't you introduce me to your mom sometime? What? <laughs> she, was, she was in town for a few weeks, man. Yeah, man, why don't you let me hook up with her? <laughs> well, you were on vacation and stuff. And Howard, is your Howard. mom blonde? Howard. No. Yeah. Shame on you. Oh, now, come I've on, seen baby. your wife. She's a beautiful young lady. <laughs> yeah, she's beautiful, but hey, variety's the spice of life. <laughs> Mr. You know, Salami. That, you know, that was, that, that was a... That, <laughs> That what? was a wild church because... <laughs> what a church! You know, you know what else happened? Yeah. A, listen to this. There's a, I need a church like that. There really? was a My church was boring. Mom, <laughs> you guys were praying to God and not Satan? Mom, I don't know if I ever told you this, and I'll tell you who the family was later, but there was a family in the church who was really connected into the church. You know, they were lay people. There are no they, names, please. They, they were in, in every event, and the, right. all their kids went to school. Okay, 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 kids. yeah. About about four years ago, I don't want to. You know what? I don't want to hear your accusations anymore. You've it's not an accusation. The wife ran off with one of the priests. In oh, the she parish. did. Yeah. Oh, what a wild place. <laughs> yeah. She ran off with that young one, right? Right. Cool. And and father. And he was good I mean, Father handled me. No, Cardinal oh. O'Connor says this is not going on, and that priest movie is ridiculous. Yeah, the priest yeah. movie is out outrageous. <laughs> and Ralph's little town in Jersey. Parish. Yeah, and, yeah and right. This is a small town. I mean, like <laughs> it's no <laughs> church. It's a whorehouse. <laughs> I mean, it's like a den of iniquity. Service. I, I think they were hitting thing. on my mom. With Did you believe it, though? Like like you were sending Ralph to him for counseling? Oh, my God. Isn't that cool? No. I mean, no. I mean, horrible. But yeah, well, no. now the guy's... Isn't he up on charges? Yeah, so... so, so when now Ralph... I'm not shocked that Ralph's a hairdresser. Ah. <laughs> now, when me and Howard started talking about it, the, the, now, like, everybody came forward and... This is for real. It's yeah. Real. Yeah, was, we're, yeah it's in the paper. What paper is this? <laughs> the Daily Record. The Inquirer. <laughs> no, it's in the uh, Daily Record. Really? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. What a way to greet the morning. I yeah. can't believe this. All right, Mrs. Salome. Uh, no, please call me Mom Howard. All right, Mom. <laughs> okay, well, thanks for letting me know. Yeah, I'd like to hook up with you next time you're in town visiting <laughs> Ralph. I'll be there soon. Because I mean, if, I the, gotta... if the church is calling you hot, then you must be hot. <laughs> I have to. Does your mom wear mini dresses and stuff? Oh, God, stop. Does she? Oh, come okay. on, man. What if, what if I hooked up with your mom? <laughs> be your dad. I'll be your dad, Ralph. Oh, that'd be cool. <laughs> yeah, I'm a cool dad. Yeah. Uh, Mrs. Salami. Cool dad. Okay, it's a, mm. it's, a big, it's a bit late for that for, how, for Ralph now. You got a young mom, huh? What, yeah. she have you when you were I, like 14? Did you have him when you were 14 or something? Listen, let's let's call this quits. I'm really shocked about this. I know. I'm very upset that you didn't tell me this then. Yeah, but you yeah, know, Ralph. I, who wants to talk about it? Nothing happened to me. I mean, if, yeah, I, sure. if I was a who knows, Mrs. Salami? <laughs> Look, I... Ralph doesn't even remember what you're telling us. We still need him hypnotized again. Yeah, we're not even sure we believe well, Ralph. He didn't even remember I dropping think... me off at the church. You, when you were naked, know. when you were naked with Father Handley. Wait a minute. Wait, you I was were naked. naked with... You tried to change into jammies. Yeah, but maybe I stayed in my underwear. I mean, I don't maybe. remember running around naked. I'm yeah. sure they made sure you took them off because it's dirty that oh, you're in the pants when you sleep. Yeah, you can't air out. Yeah. <laughs> this is going to really freak me out all day now. Okay, I'll call, I'll you'll get I'll, over it. I'll call you a little It might explain a lot of things about Ralph. Yeah, it does. It does. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Mrs. Salami. I should have stayed there a little bit longer. All right, thank you. <laughs> okay, thank you. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye, bye, Mom. Bye, Ralph. Hey, your mom sounds hot. Like, kind of young and kind of cool. She is. She's really cool. Can she pass for, like, young? I, I, don't, I don't know. Come on, man, be honest. I don't know. Is she hot? I don't. Who would think their mom is? Hot? I don't know. She got a big chest. <laughs> I no, no. I don't What's know. What's the big man. deal? I don't know. I don't, he's like Fred about Dude, that. you can't look at your mother as a woman as opposed to just I, your no, mom. I don't look. I don't look my mother over. You I know? mean, do guys like hit on her and stuff? No. Oh, they don't. No. All right. She has trouble with her back. She put on a little weight. So. Oh, she did. No. Yeah. She no. went to Doctor Sarno. So. Oh, did she good? Ralph she should be slimming her. down and looking sexy in no time. Was she real hot when you were young? Was she like a hot mom? Yeah, I've seen, I saw some pictures of her, and she's really, really cute. Yeah, with dark hair. Mm. And, Can I see those pictures? Like old black and white pictures. And like, baby. But you bring those in, man. Let's check it out. Maybe. I, I don't know if I have them. Yeah. I'd have to get them from her. I'll All bring right. some yeah. in. Yeah, Mr. Uh, evaluation yeah. doesn't know what his mom looks like. Yeah. Only picks apart everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do that. Does she have as nice an ass as you do? <laughs> Nobody does. <laughs> All right, get out of here. <laughs> That was it's fun telling and Harry like yours. <laughs> yeah. That was fun telling Ralph's mom was breaking the news. What a good, what a good judge of character she is. <laughs> <laughs> Your mom's a real good judge of character. You know, it's so bad. She's just trying to do the right thing. And yeah, like, well, you know, sometimes you got to you know open your eyes. Yeah.
Don't say bad things about the priest. No. Yeah. Yeah, right. I don't yeah, even remember. into trouble for I don't even remember her quite as quite You tried to even tell her, and she Sacrilege. wouldn't listen. Sacrilege. He's a guy. He's a guy <laughs> in a snoop in a uniform. In a robe. Yeah. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Yeah, but my mom was. How dare right you, Mother dear. dear? Mother dear. You'll no. never turn to saint in your life, Mother dear. <laughs> <laughs> All right, very good. Thanks, Ralph. Homo. Mm. Oh, come on. We still don't know the full extent of that story. Every no. time we hear about it, we learn more. It gets deeper and deeper. Yeah, it deeper seems like deeper. Father Handle Me was in Ralph's life a lot more than yeah. he knew. Yeah. I think they were dead. <laughs> <laughs> the story's opening up like a rose. <laughs> Unfolding. <laughs> opening up like Ralph. <laughs> All right, why don't we take a break, and then we'll do some news, because we've uncovered a huge story. Yeah. We'll be back.